understanding FTP. FTP stands for File Transfer Protocol, and essentially what it is is it is a program that allows you to take files on your computer and upload them to your hosting account, which is you know, your website. Uh, if you're an experienced webmaster, you may already have an FTP program that you paid money for. Qt FTP is the most popular, and uh, I, I use that. But I also use a program called FileZilla, which is free, and I can certainly recommend it because it's really nice, uh, especially for being free. But don't let that fool you because it actually has a lot going for it. You can download it here at this location, and I'm going to go ahead and show you how to take files from your computer and upload them to your hosting account through uh, FileZilla. Now, in the later videos, we're going to talk about how to actually create the files. So for the time being, you're going to have to uh, pretend that you already have the files or you know, come back to this video later once you have them. So let's go ahead and open up FileZilla. Once you download it, install it, it's a pretty painless procedure. Once you have it, I'm going to show you what to do. Okay, so here we are. I have FileZilla opened up. And basically what's going to happen here is there are going to be two windows. The one is my computer and the other is going to be our host. And what we need to do is we need to transfer the files from one to the other. So the, the first thing I want to do is go ahead and find whatever files I want to upload to my website. I find them on my actual computer. And you know, there they are. Let's pretend those are the ones that I want. And then I'm going to go ahead and enter my information here that uh, you should have from your hosting account, which would be, you know, of course, your uh, your domain name and then you know your username and password, whatever you need to be able to access your account. So I'm going to go ahead and connect to one of my hosting accounts. Okay, so I'm connected here and uh, you can see here these are the files now you don't want to just start moving files you want to make sure that you take them to the right place and uh, basically you know we have these different things here public underscore html is what we want to concern ourselves with uh, I was fooled the very first time I did this I went to www that's not what you want you want this now to go ahead and double click that and there we can see you know all the files that I already have on there um, which if it's a new account it might be blank so to move a file over you just take it and you drag it over and drop it and then it uh, transfers over Oops, sorry you can ignore that so it transfers over so of course you, know, you can highlight multiple ones or even folders and then move it over and then it just goes over uh, you can also take it and it works the other way you can move files from your website back over to your computer so what will happen then is you know we'll move them and we can take these files on our computer and then edit them with an HTML editor which we're going to cover in uh, just a minute. And that's that's basically how it works and FTP is not hard. This is a great way to, you know, update and change your site. And again, it doesn't cost anything, so you can't beat that as well. So the next thing we need to do then is figure out what in the world, how are we going to come up with uh, actual HTML files. Don't worry, it's not that hard. We're going to go ahead and start the beginning with that too. So that's how FTP works, and I will see you in the next ser series of videos to talk about uh, how to create some basic web page files. I'll see you there.